Hi guys, so in the previous episode we talked about the top trading cycle algorithm. It's a mechanism that we can apply to any uh, a house, uh, housing market. Well, but the thing is, uh, well, it's a bit a bizarre uh, a mechanism or algorithm and uh, there might be a slightly more or easier mechanisms we can think of. One of them is serial dictatorship, for example. Why don't we use serial dictatorship instead of top trading cycles? Well, the thing is, uh, this is what we're going to discuss in this episode, top trading cycle uh, it has, has a very, very strong and nice property. So uh, let's, let's talk about those properties. Well, for any housing markets, I have four theorems. Well, the first thing, first, there always exists a core matching in, in a housing market. Well, remember, uh, for many cooperative games, core can be empty. There may be no core uh, solution. But the thing is, for the housing market, well, there always exists a core, all right? Well, can we have more than one core? Well, no. Actually, it is unique, all right? So for any housing market, uh, problem, the core is going to include one and only one allocation and this allocation will be captured by the TTC algorithm, the top trading cycle algorithm. So in that sense, it's a very, very useful uh, mechanism. So the next theorem says the matching produced by the top trading cycle algorithm or mechanism is the unique core matching. I hope you did not, I mean, you, you, you catch uh, that the fact that I'm using algorithm and mechanism interchangeably, interchangeably, and yes, I, I whenever I say algorithm, I actually mean mechanism. So the next theorem says the TTC, the top trading cycle algorithm or the mechanism, is in fact strategy proof. So if you ask the agents how do you rank the houses, they actually have no incentive to lie. Okay, so that's that's perfect. The second thing, a mechanism is strategy proof. Remember we talked about, uh, I mean, up until this point, the DA algorithm. Well, it, it, is, it can be applied to, you know, a different uh, environment. But the thing is, we may slightly uh, modify it and apply it to this framework. Or a serial dictatorship, we can apply it here, maybe, uh, with some modification. So the thing is, we can come up with a bunch of other mechanisms. All right, but the question is, are they going to satisfy those nice properties like strategy proofness, efficiency, so on and so forth? So in that sense, this theorem is very, very powerful. And it says the following, think of any mechanism for housing market. Well, if you want this mechanism to be strategy proof, pretty efficient, and at the same time, individually rational, well then, you know what? There's only one such mechanism which will satisfy all those three properties in the housing market. Well, it is the TTC, the top trading cycle. So you don't really need to look at any other mechanisms. Use the TTC if your problem is housing market problem. It will always give you strategy proof. Uh, uh, well, I mean, it is strategy proof. It will always give you uh, efficient, proto efficient matching, and it will always give you individual rational uh, matching. Okay, 